Rabbit and Gina podcast. Gina uh, was performing Saturday night at Mingara, and um, what a great night. So much fun. Um, so many laughs. Uh, I wasn't sure if I was at a comedy show or a, uh, or really? a musical. Oh, really? God, you're hilarious. So let me take you through a few of my highlights from the night. Um, the moment where Gina just went, Actually, what did you do? You invited everyone to take off their bras and uh, <laughs> and underwear and shoes, and you went, "I'm going to take one off right now." <laughs> and uh, you went, "It's the shoes." And uh, well, so, they're not used to it. People aren't used to going out and, and being all dressed up and having high heels and bras so and funny. stuff on. Mid show, <laughs> Gina just removes her shoes, but not just removes her shoes. She's like, "Hang on, these are really hard to get off." Asks Rod, the hubby, to come over and help take the <laughs> shoes off. Rod gives her nothing, so she sits down. <laughs> It was like watching Adele live, I reckon, in so many aspects. Um, but sitting down on stage and uh, taking the shoes off and then go, oh, that's better. Uh, we did have to pause for a while for you to get back up. Um, it takes longer oh, these it's days. hard to it? get up, yeah. 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 In Again. long, sparkly stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, and I will say as well, actually, in the comparison to Adele, seriously, I was blown away. I know you can sing. Hey, you can sing. You're a singer. You've, you've had a massive long career and won a gazillion awards and things. But, oh, God, the girl got pipes. Oh, thank you. Oh, my God. In fact, you can hear a bit of it in um, – I'll play a bit of the – so I got up and did a song with Gina, um, which she – God, she begged me. Um, <laughs> oh, whenever someone's got a gig, I'll throw out oh, – I'll jump up. I loved it. It was – you were fantastic. Zero preparation. Did not rehearse. No rehearsal. Did not know who was going to do what line. Nope. We stood there and looked at each <laughs> other and, uh, like, the music starts playing and Gina goes, uh, just before, like, right before the first line, Gina goes, want me to start? And I'm like, okay. And so <laughs> and so Gina, Gina takes first verse. I took second verse uh, is what we just, with our eyes, we communicated <laughs> that. But then how she starts it, Gina starts it, and I'm just standing there on stage, like, looking at everyone going, Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God, what have I got myself into? So uh, I'll, I'll play a bit of it. This is from... Oh, uh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is, oh. this is uh, someone was filming in the crowd oh. from Saturday Night at Mingara. This is Gina starting off the song, Oh, Darling, by the Beatles. Oh, Stop it. What are you doing? I wasn't going to do that. And, and just so, I was so amused by how little preparation went into it. <laughs> Doesn't matter. It's very much like this show. <laughs> oh, a lot like this show. Um, and uh, actually, so Melinda, you were there. You wanted to say something about it. Just want to ring up and say we had a fantastic night. It was a great show. And Rabbit, my God, who knew you could sing? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, it was fun. It was so fun. It was, it was a, a great atmosphere, a great show. It was. We just had a really good time. Aww, yeah, thanks. thanks. Well, we've got a few more gigs coming up soon. Uh, <laughs> oh, beautiful. <laughs> The next show I'll do two songs, and then the next show I'll do three. You <laughs> just push me out eventually. And then, uh, and then if you'd like to see Gina come along and open up for me, we've got a... Um... <laughs> the Rabbit and Gina podcast. I've been checking out the Aldi catalogue. I went to Aldi last week for the groceries. Did you? Oh, I, I, it's awesome in there. You did a bit of that thing. Did you do the, uh, the compare the prices thing? No, I Kinda. just went in no. and just bought whatever looked good. <laughs> <laughs> And I got a, I got the catalogue, and and I found something I thought that you might like that that'd be handy. Who says no to the catalogue? 
when they get to the end there and just go, and would you like uh, next week's uh, catalogue? Yes, please. No, thanks. I don't want to find out about your awesome Bluetooth party speaker (laughs) that I didn't know I needed in my life. (laughs) Oh, the new new bar fridge. And a bar fridge (laughs) and a a, um, pop-up gardening shed. Yeah. <laughs> oh, winter jackets, snow yeah. jackets. Oh, it just amuses me the things that uh, me too that pop up. There. And it's the fun bit. So you're going along, you get your fruit and your and your meat and stuff, and then you come to the fun middle. Yeah, you're like hello. I don't even know they have fruit and meat and stuff. <laughs> Do you just go straight to the middle? In the door, straight to the middle <laughs> aisle. Man, that one at Erina, it's like it's two full rows, so you got to do four like laps. L- laps. Yeah, mm. you got to up, down, up. Down. Yeah. I can't look at both sides of the aisle as I'm oh, walking down either. the middle. No. <laughs> me okay. too. Okay, down left, one side. Look to the left. Don't look right. Don't and then come back. Don't look don't look right. Because you're gonna get distracted <laughs> and you're gonna go over and look over there and you'll forget where you were on this aisle. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so what do you reckon I would have seen? I would have thought Rab's <laughs> Well, I've actually got Rabs the catalogue here. like that. Um, I've got to tell him about it because I think he'll like it. While you were talking, <laughs> I've been typing away over here and I've brought up the catalogue. So um so something that would appeal to me. You say, yeah, well, a, a lot of a lot well, of not people. Not the liquor section, obviously. So no, not that. That's, that's uh, my section. They do a nice rosé just quietly. Do it, I? Yeah. Well, that's uh, that's uh, unhelpful <laughs> knowledge to me. Oh, look at this! A four K QLED Android TV. Oh, that's not bad, actually. How much? Um, How much are they asking? <laughs> <laughs> Tell them they're dreaming. <laughs> I don't need another TV. If anything, I've got too many. Oh, a hard an- anodized fry pan. Yeah. Nope. That's not they it. Have ruined ours. Yeah. Um, so no, okay, no, kebabs. No. Oh my god, I've seen it. What? I will. <laughs> I bet you anything. I'll bet my house on this. That okay. This is the thing that you and I actually am in the market for one oh. of these. Do you reckon I got it? I've na- I've nailed you. Well, if you if that yeah, that's not too hard to do. What is it? Chainsaw. <laughs> no, no, no. But I could see you with a chainsaw. Yeah, I, you'd my, be dangerous. You cut your finger on like paper. My wife was quite shocked the other day when she found out <laughs> I did not own a chainsaw. I think I don't know if it's a good idea. You and a chainsaw. You the other day me? you had a bandit on the back of your head and your finger was bleeding and um, you've always got like you've not always a day on injured. The tools without a bit of blood, Gina. You're always injured. I don't think it's we my, should add a. <laughs> it's my company motto. <laughs> it's not a day, it's not a solid day on the tools without a bit of blood. It happens every single time, every day when I'm on the tills, I bleed a bit. Yeah. A, ble- a little bit or a lot. I don't know. It depends. And sometimes it's just leeches. Um, well, no, e- either thing. way, there's there's blood, yes. Yeah. No. Well, this. Well, do you want me to tell you what I thought yeah, you might like? Yeah, I can't find it. So I mean... there, there was this section that ha- I don't know if it's this week's or last week's, but there was this section that um, like an, uh, a steam iron. You know, where you can just hold... Oh, how dare you. Hang on. I know where you're going. I no. know. Are you saying so I can uh, um, steam out the wrinkles in my face? <laughs> no. No, a steam iron that you can you can iron your clothes. You haven't got to put it down. And that's such a good idea. I know the thing. But it, we, we have one here. Do we? In the, in yeah. the station. So yeah. we can come in crinkly. Yeah, because we used to have these... <laughs> where these songs? <laughs> <laughs> so throw back to Julie Goodwin days, oh. and we had these um, big um, signs. I think I believe they're called teardrops. Oh, uh, the, the banners, the yeah, 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 and the flappy yeah. material. Yeah, yeah. And we'd turn up to events, and because they'd just been thrown in the back of the van, they'd be all crinkly. Oh, and that's stuff. not a good look. And then, yeah, someone, one of the road stars, would have to get out with the steam thing and go Shh, to get all the crinkles oh. out. And um, we'd always have a bit of a laugh and go, "It's actually not. They're not. Cr- that's just the photo. <laughs> <laughs> you want to get the crinkles out? Bring it over here." <laughs> <laughs> do that before we do the photo shoot, then maybe you won't have to deal with that <laughs> exactly. later on. <laughs> well, no, it wasn't. It, but what comes no. with the steamer, which Go I on. thought I, I like the sound of it. It's this little attachment, and it and it removes your balls. <laughs> it's a ball remover or or a pill remover. You know, it's just you you attach it and run along. <laughs> You know, do you know now when you now that I've glanced at you and you're running along your arm, <laughs> it's changed the whole story. <laughs> you know those things. You know when your your clothes get a bit pilly and you get little balls on your clothes. No. You got there's this thing that you can. I'm not a nana. You can get for, no, no. Your t-shirt. Let me have a look. At your t-shirt. You've got oh that one hasn't got any balls on it. But you, after a little, if you put in the clothes dryer too many times, it gets little little pills and little balls on it. I am unaware of this phenomenon. And there's this thing, and you run it along and it cuts the little balls off. You know? Really? Yeah. Oh, Loz is excited by that. Yeah, a little bill, a little little really? little pill cutter. A little, little, you know, your clothes can pill up. 
Yeah, oh, see? Loz is looking at her <laughs> bag and it's got all things all over it. You want to? I haven't got any on me. You need a pill remover. Yeah, a little ball How remover. Handy, Aldi yeah. ball removers. Yeah, <laughs> Caref- careful when you go googling it. The Rabbit and Zena Podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcast.com.au.